so I think we were working on... Oh, we don't have enough ceramic for this. Okay. Oh, are we making ceramic? We are. Okay. Turns clay into ceramic. Do we have clay? <laughs> Do we have clay? Alright, we have uh, 212 tons of clay, apparently. So, we, we got a little bit. Let me uh, unpause the game. I think things were... Okay, we left it in, in an okay place where nothing is going to break. Uh, we had moved the metal refinery. Alright, so we're, we're working on getting the resources to make uh, the monument. Right? Uh, which, which was what? <laughs> it was a lot of stuff. A lot of steel and glass. And I think there was some diamond needed and some other stuff. What is that under? Is that under furniture? I don't remember. Yeah. So we need seven and a half tons of steel and 2,500 kilograms of obsidian. Uh, let me know also if the game sound is too quiet or too loud or I am or uh, any any of those things. Should be fine, but it helps to ask. <laughs> it's good to just ask. Uh, no liquid up. Okay, so we're still working on piping to there so this is the glass forge I've never used this before but the idea is we can make molten glass and I think what I'm having it do is it's gonna just pump it. it's gonna come out of this vent and it's gonna land in our uh, pool of water down here and cool off eventually and it's all fine because we have a bunch of steam in this room it's gonna it's gonna just give us more power once we have uh, oh, yeah, well, look, we're, we're producing ceramic right there. Let me, let me zoom out a little bit so it's not quite so loud. Um, hmm. And then I think we have a bunch of work queued to make steel. Yeah, I just said infinite. Make all the steel. So how is our coolant doing? That was a concern last time around and why we had to move things. So now we're using petroleum. Coming in, and it's uh, 137C. That is maybe okay. Alright, so we're using the radiant pipe to cool it. Yeah, I think that's fine. Uh, the worst case is the petroleum overheats. If it does, then the pipes will break and release sour gas, uh, which would be bad. How bad would it be? I'm not sure. <laughs> we probably have to do like the thing we did before where we uh, set up some pumps and filters and stuff to uh, uh, get it out. Well, but look, we, we finished our pipe. So let's make some glass. Now, we need glass for the, uh, the monument. So uh, I think I talked about this briefly last time. I, I see a problem here. I should dig this out. Um, it looks like maybe some sand fell down from oh when we were digging this and potentially blocked things. I think we had alternate routes, but yeah. Dupes cannot uh, climb over walls. <laughs> so there we go. Uh, oh, and this is this is flooded. That's bad. Um, what was this transformer for? Maybe nothing, actually. Oh yeah, for some things. Hold on, we need to fix this. Can we mop this? Normally, with this much fluid, you would not be able to mop it, but because it's a bunch of different liquids, some of them are just small amounts, like 13 grams of polluted water here and there. So maybe we can mop that up enough for it not to be flooded anymore. And that would be good. Um, how to save? There we go. <laughs> what was I going to check? I was going to check something. We don't have... Right, we don't have our, our ship in orbit anymore. But we do. No, we don't. It's, it's landed, right? It's, uh... 
because we got all the data banks we needed for the research last stream. I think we went an extra hour, right? Uh, so the rocket came back and we're all closed up. Well, that's interesting. This is open. Maybe that was there before when we opened it. I don't know what the deal is with that. But uh, what was I going to check? I was going to check something. Uh, and I get distracted. Um, I don't know that we need... I don't know that I want to feed these um, Phosphorite anymore. Yeah, that's fine. Let's see if our phosphorite for other things. Especially since we are, I guess, done with research. Oh, now I remember. <laughs> like, what are we trying to do here? Uh, and I think the answer to what we're trying to do um, was to build the monument. The reason being, apparently, according to the printing pod, which is the thing we start the game with. Oh, our morale has dropped. That's not good. But we had 16 morale before, um, but it's um, a win condition, I guess, is, is what it seems like to me, is to do all four of these things. So build a great monument, print at least 12 duplicates, maintain 16 morale, and survive 200 cycles. Um, for some reason, our dupes morale has dropped. So, how do we see... I think that would only count morale on this planet. I could be wrong. Because I don't think we had 60 morale over in Smirlos anyway. I could be wrong. Maybe we did because we didn't skill these guys up more? We can always use a skill scrubber or bring them back or improve morale over there. One of those things. I think the, the big thing to do, though, is to... Uh, uh, build the monument. And then that's going to be kind of a capstone for the series, and then uh, it's on to the next game, uh, which I've already bought, uh, Mind Over Magic. I've not played yet, though. I've seen, like, maybe an hour of footage of. But, uh, yeah, should be interesting. Should be <laughs> lots of things going wrong, probably. Um, so... What do we need again? Steel and obsidian. So, it says we have five tons of obsidian in various places, so maybe it'll be okay. Maybe I'll just say, go ahead and start sweeping this stuff. Hmm, go. Obsidian. Sweet. I'm not really sure. I'm not sure when, um, because like in furniture it says it's red, right? Missing resources, obsidian, and steel. I'm not sure why both are red, but uh, it's fine. I'm gonna I'm gonna focus on getting the steel. I guess we're we're kind of doing that. We're at uh, four thousand eight hundred eighty kilograms. So, my understanding is a thousand kilograms is what this game means by a ton. So, when we when we, we hit 5,000 kilograms, that should be five tons, right? And so that should be enough for the base. And we're almost there. Oh no, it's seven and a half tons. Okay, so we're not quite there, but we're working on it. Uh, the other thing we could be doing uh, we did build a transit tube from here up. We could also build a transit tube over to here to uh, speed things up, like to the the door here. Uh, yeah, that could be good. I don't know why. Why is there a piece of sand there? But uh, yeah, yeah, we could we could put some tiles over here. How big is the um, the transit tube station? Transit tube access. It's three tiles across, so we could we could just slap it right there. 
Uh, put some tiles under it. I don't think that blocks anything. A, a wild plancher appears in chat, whatever that is. Um, but we, yeah, we could, we could do some transit tubes. Can transit tubes cross uh, ladders? Can we go? Nope. Hmm. Okay. So I think what I'm gonna do, because this is a good spot for it. Um, let's, <laughs> yeah, catch that. Uh, let's deconstruct some of the stuff here. And buildings, there we go. We'll move those ladders from there and we'll, uh, we'll have our tube come straight up through here. To there. And that'll give us kind of a, a clear shot all the way up. Maybe I'll put another transit station here while I'm at it. Yeah. Okay. It will eventually be a valid location. And then uh, we'll remove the stuff here. And some tiles here. There we go, there we go. Aw, it escaped. Now, hmm, how is this gonna work? How are we gonna get the tube? I guess we can have a gap in the ladder, but no, because the, hmm. I can have the tube go across this way. We don't need this tile here anymore. And that would give us room. Now the question is, if I put the tile, if I put the transit tube here, um, we, can, we can still get across this. We just remove the ladder. So the dupes will, if they want to get up here, they'll go up. Wait. Oh, that's a problem. I mean, I guess it's fine anyway. Why, why would dupes go over here? <laughs> Use a power world all this time? Yeah, I was joking uh, the other day. Uh, maybe it was in Marcy's chat. When is when is there going to be a, a, a PAL world uh, community game? Instead of <laughs> Pokemon? Hmm... That. Okay, well now that's not reachable. I guess we are going to need more ladder. Should be good. Um, but I guess with this, so that's there. Can these be connected? Okay, but does that still connect to the? I don't know how this is supposed to work. But actually, if I'm gonna if I'm gonna do all this, then I guess I should. Hmm, I might change my mind. Let's let's do this. Cancel this. Cancel this. Rebuild this ladder, I guess. And we'll go across. Can trains it? So I think I don't know because I've not used these things too much. Can trains tubes actually connect? Like this? I just don't know. <laughs> it's cool to get, seeing stuff go over on the uh, conveyor rail to get delivered over there. Hey, uh, Dan HD, how's it going? Welcome. How are you doing this fine Friday, maybe evening? <laughs> Depending on where you are. So, can this connect? Can, can you, okay, he's probably, he's gonna do that, okay. Uh, so if I click this, and then I go here, okay, it can form like a T-junction. Maybe that'll work, although that looks weird. That doesn't seem right.
Oh, and they can walk through this. Okay, so that's not that's not gonna block anything. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Then we can do this. Uh I'm you're good? 2 a.m. there. Okay, well good morning then. <laughs> uh one last visit. Uh I had to uh one last I had to visit before I said okay. Well thanks for coming by. So I guess uh it's late rather than early. Alright, so what uh, I guess we're gonna send the transit to this way. <laughs> Yeah, Foxy's here too. Foxy's always here. Foxy's great. 10 out of 10, would recommend. This particular fox. Hey, Brainless. <laughs> How's it going? Yeah, it's fam. That's... Uh... Yep. <laughs> uh, you came over here from uh, where? Did, which stream did I see you in? I was looking in like six different streams before I semi asleep. You were either in Death Row Gaming stream or were you in Hogmatics' stream? One of the two. <laughs> Alright, so we have this here. Can we... Oh yeah, also, let's dig out the sand. You were in both. Okay, well, there you go. I was... <laughs> Me too. Me too. Uh, let's see, so can we... How do we do this? Yeah, sleep would be great. I gotta, I gotta stream this, though. <laughs> Aww. Appreciate you being here, Foxy. Let's let's dig out. Uh, this is gonna be an annoying amount of sand to dig out. We could dig out the sand and go through here, or I have kind of a gap here. I could send. Hmm. Yeah. Let's do this. So I'll deconstruct this ladder, and I'll destroy this ladder. What's that sound? Hmm. Was that maybe this thing? <laughs> uh, I mentioned something to you, but I guess you missed it. Upgraded the base today. Oh, and uh, I don't know. <laughs> where, where did you mention it? Uh, are you talking about in Power World? Whoops. Sorry if I missed it. Yep. Okay, cool. Um, I, I figured if that was this morning or when it was, but I figured out how to password secure the, the server. So maybe you saw that message and were able to get on after, but it was kind of bugging me that just anyone could join. <laughs> you noticed that, right? Okay, so we're gonna... So I don't know if the trans tubes are actually gonna work like this, but I'm gonna, oops, I'm gonna try to go down like, like, like this. No, 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 like, like, yeah, not like that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I use Foxy's emotes everywhere. I need to work on my own um, in terms of like the animated ones. But in the meantime, <laughs> Foxy's are great. I mean, I like mine too, the ones that I have, except for the, I don't really care, honestly, for the, the little animated dance one. Uh, it was the best, the best I could do. I like Jake's emotes too. Uh, he's got a good theme there with the, with the shrimp. All right, where are we taking this pipe? I guess we're going down here, yeah? Um, I could, let's see, let's do this. Let's kind of go in a straight line here if we can. Is this? Presumably this is reachable. 
Uh, I use this everywhere even though he stopped streaming over here, yeah? But yeah. Yeah, I have seen you use that a couple times. Hmm. This is the most transit tube I've ever put down. <laughs> oh, that's that's wrong. There we go. Okay, this way. And down there. Maybe this will work. Uh, you heard it here first, guys. I'm actually going to start a giveaway for when I see you using my emotes in someone's chat. I'll add your name in, then do a drawing for a prize. So wow. Do we get to know what the prize is, or is that a secret and or undecided? Alright, so this is just complaining that it's not... What is it complaining about? Maybe the wire is not connected? No, there's a wire there. Um, maybe it's not charging, because not yet? Okay, cool. I think it's not charging because the tube is not connected? Yeah, now it's charging. All right, starts in February. All right, excited to hear more. Uh, oh, I see. Okay, cool, 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 cool. So this is all gonna eventually get connected up. We might even have enough plastic to do this. There we go. Uh, is this? This should be reachable. We just don't want to bother to connect that up yet. Uh, that's connected to there. All right. So we'll have dupes flying all over the place here eventually. So they can come over here and work on our uh, metal refinery. Uh, we have seven tons of steel. In the meantime, <laughs> Greenland says, okay, I guess I need to be at it. All right. It's an appropriate emote to use. The Join a giveaway. Is the fox holding a present? Hmm. All right. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Mostly waiting for dupes. Now. Interesting. What even is this game? Uh, is this game does look fun? Question uh, mark. So this is oxygen not included. I did put it in the the, the game title. Yeah, is oxygen not included? Uh, so this is like a colony sim. Yeah, it's pretty fun. I've been playing <laughs> since apparently like July. This game specifically, uh, three hours ish a week. Um, and I had played it a little bit before, but uh, this is the first time I'm kind of approaching one of the like milestone things. But yeah, you start off with just a couple of little guys, uh, not in not in spacesuits. Just a couple of little guys and a little pocket of air in the middle of an asteroid, and then you do research, uh, mine resources, build a base, uh, you know, farm creatures, produce oxygen, produce electricity, do material science, uh, build a rocket, go to other uh, asteroids if you have the, the spaced out DLC, um, other things. <laughs> so we actually have another asteroid here that uh, we're... Hey look! All of, all of the stuff that was queued up is finally done because we actually have like a place for the the liquid to go, <laughs> I guess. Yeah, because this was much lower before. Uh, here's a, a pool of uh, ethanol here on this particular asteroid. I, sw I guess we could actually use that. Uh, how are these? Oh, I'm glad I looked at them. They have 5,000 calories. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, yeah, I know, It's it's been broken. And I'm not bothered to fix it because they've been fine, right? 
but I think they've just been living off of uh, what was left over from before. Uh, and right, so we have no water here because we don't have polluted water. I mean, there's lots of polluted water somewhere, right? Or did we use it? Oh, there's a little bit here. Uh, there's a bunch over here. Hmm, what do? Oh yeah, we have a, uh, a liquid pump. What were we doing with that? That was going up here. Oh, we were... Okay, we got this going. We could switch the farm over to... Uh... Also, we have uh, a blockage there. We could switch over the farm tiles over to hydroponic and continue to, to grow uh, bog bucket. Uh, we should probably get a more immediate source of food, though. So, let's see here. Let's flag things for harvest. <laughs> yeah, much more time. <laughs> maybe so, maybe so. Well, I mean, we can probably dig up a few things for some of the uh, what you what you may call a root. Trixie just raided with three viewers. <laughs> it doesn't know how to say your name though, but thank you for the raid. Welcome, raiders. Uh, Marxie's the mastermind behind a streamer alliance. Are we a streamer alliance? We never really talked about that, but sure. Uh, uniting hunter dogs with a chill British vibe. Uh, lots of calories, those cactus like green plants. Uh, are we talking about. You're not talking about these, are you? The swamp charts? Or are you? The Nosh Sprouts? Yeah, lots of hype. Again, welcome. We are uh, trying to figure out how to keep the two dupes that are living here on this little planet planetoid alive. Uh, no, right ladder, bottom of it. Right ladder. Uh, oh, yeah, 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 the Hex... The hex Excellent, yes. They are excellent. Uh, incapable of propagating, but can be harvested for a single calorie-dense food serving. Alright, so we'll... I mean, I guess uh, auto harvesting and uprooting does the same thing, because they're single serving. But, uh, there you go. I guess we were keeping that in reserve for now. So I prioritize that. And there's another one down here we can get to. We're not really using this water, so I could dig down. Maybe not exposing the geyser, <laughs> but I could dig down. Um, ooh, there's some meat in there, too. Let's just go down here. There we go. Careful with that right ladder dig. Why? Why? Obsidian. Why would there be a problem? Mathic rock? Rust? I don't see a geyser. I don't see anything that's gonna fall. You wanna give me another hint? <laughs> Brainless? Uh, the 
can't go down to. I'm not sure they can go left one. Hmm, I mean, the Jeep should be able to get here. Let's take a look. What's this gonna do? A bit higher of the door. Oh, right, right, right. So if we dig this, I mean, we don't need to anyway. We found some other food. But yeah, so if we dig this, then they wouldn't necessarily be able to get to the next ladder. Yes, I get it. I get it. Uh, I mean, while I'm here, I might as well just also make another ladder there. Sorry, my, my mind had already moved on to, like, the stuff down here. I wasn't thinking about the stuff up here, really. Uh, other than the thing that I was thinking about before when I put the orders, which is like, nothing's gonna fall, right? But, uh, yeah, you're right. If, uh, if I had dug this out, then I don't think they would be able to get up there anymore. But this should be fine. Yeah. Cool. Thanks. So, Marxy. I saw you, you got, you, how long did you uh, stream for, by the way, if you're still here? It was like four or five hours, wasn't it? Which is not your longest stream, but it's a pretty good chunk of time. Marcy might also be <laughs> getting ready to go to sleep. It's kind of early or late. Oh, he was dead in prison. Oh, wow. Uh, I missed that part, I think. Also, welcome Foxy <laughs> Foxy Blue the Raider. Oh, uh, he afk for the puppies. Well, you, you gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, also, uh, we can probably enable harvest of these things. And there we go. We get some calories. We'll be, we'll be okay. Um, I should, though, do something about... Uh, actual food. So we have water here for now. Do I want to continue using this area for the farm tile or do I want to go over here? That's what she said. <laughs> Just the, who, whose emote is that? Uh, no one I know. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's see. Can we... Hydroponic farm. <laughs> no clue random yet. Alrighty, alrighty. Um... That should be enough, maybe. Let's get some pipes down. Uh, eventually we'll have to probably put the pump like up here to use this like this stuff does need polluted water right fog bucket polluted water okay I mean we can do other things but this this seems like the easiest thing to be able to leave this and get back to the thing we were working on which was the monument it's not that I don't enjoy playing the game, but I do want to—I want to get to this finish line uh, and do some other things. All right, so apparently we can't plant fog buckets. Oh yeah, we need to uproot the ones over here, don't we? Uh, let's see. So I can probably copy this setting. Nope, that does not cause it to be uprooted. Apparently. So what is the uh, gas situation looking like over here? We have we have a lot of natural gas <laughs> accumulating. It's very cold. We have a, a flatulent dupe on this planetoid that's 
part of the reason these two dupes are over here is because they're kind of unpleasant to have in our proper base. Uh, so we are producing, you know, some amount of natural gas. Has any of it liquefied? No. Doesn't look like it. We got some liquid carbon dioxide in our cold biome down here. Uh, I think I explored a bit too much today. I reached an area where everything was level 20 plus. Yeah. Uh, yeah, did we... It does? <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, not much to do there. It seemed to me that the thing to do was find a bunch of the... Uh, I assume we're still... We're, we're talking about Power World. Uh, the thing to do is find a bunch of the Lip Monk effigies and, like, increase your capture power. Yeah, in trouble. <laughs> That's my problem in Upworld games. They get too excited to explore and get yourself into trouble. Well, I mean, Foxy saw this when I was testing the game out on Sunday. Um, the thing I was doing was just going as far as I can, trying to get to the next batch travel point and do lots of exploration and enabling to go further when I was ready. And hey, Jake, bouncing between here and a Discord chat. Welcome, welcome. Uh, I did two levels of that today. Forgot I had them. Nice. Uh, auto save? Yep, auto save. Mm -hmm. All right, so we have, we still don't. So we uprooted them. Where did the bog bucket seed go? Hmm. Also, you destroyed the old, old hot houses. Okay. Now we have individual rooms in a two bedroom apartment. I see. So Brainless has <laughs> built a new house and moved me into it. Let's see. Uh, this is fine. Why can't I plant? It says I don't have any, but I surely do. Because there was some over here that I uprooted. Hmm. Uh, in the meantime, I guess we can harvest these Paku. Oh yeah, ladders over there broken. That's that's fine. I think I raised four or five levels to base. Uh, we can have a second base now. Nice. Well, that should uh, enable some more interesting uh, things. I think get some more things going. Like if we have multiple bases, then presumably, like having a second. <clears throat> Excuse me. Having a second base should mean like the number of uh, pals that we can run, you know, doing stuff would double, right? Because instead of having X number of pals working at one base, now you have two bases, presumably both bases have that limit, or then, you know, the next limit up. More automation. Colony achievement earns. Have, uh, oh nice. It's also a steam achievement. My, my first time getting this. You think we should do an ore base? Okay. Yeah, I was seeing in my uh, my YouTube feed someone, uh, Sejin, is doing a Power World series, and his second video was about doing uh, automated ore. So that seems things. You've been struggling with that? Is it just a matter of finding a good spot? Totally tubular. Have duplicates travel 10,000 meters, 10 kilometers, by transit tube. All right. I got an achievement. <laughs> Accidentally. All right, so we got this set up, and this is all working, I guess. Maybe we'll see a dupe using the transit tube. Maybe uh, Nicola over here, when he's done, will use the transit tube. There he goes. Awesome. 
Uh, yeah, I've been running back and forth, getting ore. Almost have enough for the crossbow. Oh, wow, there's a crossbow. That makes sense. That's a bridge, right, between just the the normal or the three-shot bow and then, then guns, firearms. So... All right, what are we at? We're at 8.9 tons of steel. So can we can we build this thing yet? And where are we gonna build the monument is a question that I've not really thought about. Oh, hey, look, I can. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, no, no worries. I mean, that that is hardly a spoiler. There's technology. <laughs> I mean, I already knew there were guns and you can see the tech tree all the way in at the end where there's like missiles, missile launchers and things like that. So it's all good. Uh, maybe we'll build the monument base out here. Or should we do it inside the base? How big is it? Uh, I guess I don't need these ladders going across. Let's remove ladders and we'll do the monument right here. Or over here. Or right here. <laughs> he picked a bad place to stand. All right. Uh, I got a raid of two level 17 dodos, weirdly. They began running away, so I chased them and captured one. Nice. So how tall is the, uh, oh right, so there's a midsection and a top. So, I mean, we could remove, do you think it'll fit in this space? Do you know, Brainless, how tall the total, like, height of the monument is? Is there, um, there is a way this way, so we could remove the tiles here. You don't think so? Okay. Uh, I'm gonna bet, though, that it will fit here. It's large. I, I think, given the proportions, I suspect the base and uh, midsection. If not, I can always expand the base up. We'll do it there. Uh, but to be honest, 1,300 hours never bother to do a monument. Well, there you go. All right, make the monument base. How long does it take? How long does it take to do the monument base? All right, and then what's the next one? Uh, let's see, furniture is the midsection. So we need 2,500 kilograms of ceramic, 2,500 kilograms of plastic. Uh, we have that. Plastic. Um, I don't think I'm tracking so... Oh, I am. Okay, so we need more ceramic. And we need steel again because we just used all of our steel. But we're, we're making all the steel. Maybe. Oh, this is... Why is this not done? That's the missing bit that makes things more efficient. Okay, so, uh, what's it? Steel. Uh, we are producing steel. We have lots of refined carbon, and lots of lime, and lots of iron. Uh, but in terms of ceramic, just to make ceramic, well, I guess forever is fine. <laughs> I'll turn that off later. Uh, we should get going on glass. Let's try making tin glass. We did need glass, right? That was a thing. Furniture. For the monument top. Yeah, 25, 25, so 2.5 2 tons of glass. 2.5 tons. So, tip for the steel refinery, bin next to it and a sweeper will be a bit faster, okay. Yeah, the, the bin used to be next to it. Uh, and then we moved things. Last stream. So, we need a hundred. 
I don't think we can put 100 in here. We can put 99. There we go. That should be fine. Uh, let's go ahead and make another storage bin. And a mesh tile. And a sweeper. That won't reach. Uh, that won't reach. That will reach. Should be fine. There you go. Alright, did we, um... Okay, now it's all connected. Great. <laughs> I probably should have done that, like, um... 20 something hours ago or more. <laughs> hmm. Alright, here we go. Our first class. Blueprints available. Alright, alright. Uh, next game. Oh, yeah. Whoops. I should pay attention to what material I use. <laughs> oh, it's because they don't have any steel, right? Uh, or I didn't at the time, maybe? Okay, that doesn't reach anymore anyway, so that's good. Uh, I think I can just get rid of these ladders. There we go. Don't need those ladders anymore. All right, and then we'll copy settings over to here. Nope, nope, that failed. Try that again. Copy settings. <laughs> Hit paste. Okay. You, apparently, you cannot paste th through a dupe. <laughs> As it turns out. Uh, let's see, auto sweeper, out of steel, yes. Okay, we need. Okay, that that is reachable. We're just waiting for someone to remove the ladder. And it says, okay, it's fine. Let's prioritize removing that. So what are we at? We're up to uh, 2.7 kilograms of steel. Try rotating it. Yeah, that's an idea. Oh yeah, I bet, I bet, I bet that uh, if we were to rotate, uh, O to rotate, yeah. Yeah, good one. Then we can just put it right there. Add a, add a steel, please. <laughs> this time. Uh, hmm. I'll put it right there. Because I think maybe what we can do... Maybe if we deconstruct a couple of these mesh tiles... Maybe the auto-sweeper will be able to reach that. And just move the stuff for us. Actually, you know, I have a better idea. Which is... Um, remove this tile. And... Turn off all that. Yeah, and then deconstruct. And we need power also to the auto sweeper, uh, which we almost have. There we go. So thank you for the suggestion. They've still not deconstructed the ladder. Uh, they can reach that, right? Maybe they can't. I guess not. That's one, two, three, four. Okay. Those aren't reachable. Despite the game not saying it's not reachable. It's not reachable. Alright. Uh, okay. Yay. Oh, yeah. So, did we make glass? Is it sitting down here? There it is. We got 150 kilograms of glass there.
contributing to the heat of the room. It's great. What else were we doing? Oh yeah, we should probably check on Smirlos, huh? Uh, can we plant... Why can't we plant bog, bog buckets? We had them. Did we eat them all? No, they they leave seeds, right? Oh wait, 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 wait. No. Did we? Oh yeah. Okay, interesting. So that's where all of our seeds were going. <laughs> yep, yep. We don't need that there anyway because we're not we don't have Baku. So. Uh, there we go. Plant. Copy. Paste. Yay! 